someone was trying to extort money from me. Yeah, and they weren't even family. <laughs> so chinga testa, watch. I get a phone call from my manager telling me that someone reached out claiming to have video footage of me being inappropriate with models. Yeah, see? Look at, look at. <laughs> you guys are like me. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I need to see it too. <laughs> now, no disrespect to any woman who has ever given me the opportunity. <laughs> but none of them were models. <laughs> maybe a couple of cochinas from West Covina, maybe. But they were not models. They were not models. They were just good citizens. Thank you. So anyway, they said I had until 9 a.m. to make a deposit of $50,000 into an account, or they were going to release the footage to TMZ, and my career was going to be over. When I got the message, it was already 6 p.m. So I had missed the deadline by like half a day. So I was like, well, let me turn on the TV, still, you know, see if I still got a yab. And clearly this is the first time you guys are hearing about this because there was no footage. They were just trying to scare me into giving them money. The only reason why I'm telling you the story is because only 50,000? <laughs> like seriously, that's what my career is worth? <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I know when I said 50,000, some of you were like, oh, and it is a lot of money. But if you're gonna go after a celebrity, $50,000 is really low. Like, to put into perspective, they did the same thing to Kevin Hart. And with Kevin Hart, they hit him for 10 million. 10 million, which lets me know where I stand on the comedy totem pole of success. There's Kevin Hart with 10 million, and I am like the Groupon of extortion. Where'd you get your extortion? Got that shit at Ross. It was on clearance. $50,000, you can't even buy an Escalade with $50,000. That is like a Hyundai Sonata at best, okay? And that's like a base model, like you still gotta do this shit to the window, you know? $50,000, but 